Happy Friday, Mountain Movers. Relentless was a word that we discussed in Daily Motivations this week. When I think about relentless, I think about pedal down, continuing to go after the goal, regardless of adversity, regardless of the things we face, regardless of obstacles. We take choice out of the equation and make whatever relentless is tied to a non-negotiable. And one of Mountain Mover Facade's core values is relentless consistency. So we're going to keep showing up the way we say we're going to show up, even when we don't want to, even when it gets tough. So where do you need to show a little bit more relentlessness and take it beyond just a buzzword people use and actually apply it to your life? And it rolls great into the next Daily Motivation where we talked about, remember, when you knock on the door of opportunity, it's work who shows up and answers that door. And I would argue if it's not work that answers that door, you might be knocking on the wrong door of opportunity. And so we could get stuck in the busyness and the hurry and all that sort of stuff. We need to remember why we're fighting for, for and what we're fighting for. And when it's tied to something big, you know that work is just part of the process rather than just getting lost in the daily execution and, and you just start getting beat down. Make sure it's tied to something big. And if it's tied to an opportunity that's tethered to a purpose, it's worth fighting for. The last one was tied to the Bible, Proverbs 13, 20, where it says, walk with the wise and become wise, associate with fools and get in trouble. Pretty plain and simple. And we have leadership books that talk about, you are the sum of the five closest people to you. Show me your friends and I'll show you your future. And I call it finding your tribe. And there are people that bring us up and people that bring us down. And when we absorb those character traits from those people, we end up passing it around to the people around us, whether we like it or not. And so do you like what you're giving off to other people and what you're consuming from people? And if you don't like it, do you need to start spacing away from some of those people that are bringing you down or not taking you to where you're trying to be? Finish strong. Happy Veterans Day to all of our veterans out there. Thank you for your service, especially Dan Bradley.